get him yeah. just finish the race disappointed that nathan allen isn't out there all eight finishers in this race could be selected to go to the final event of the championships is on tap now men's 400 meters final set 45 sent about their business it's a clean start chris taylor was away well demish gay is up there as well kino burrell bailey is laying out as well on the outside we've got burrell and mcdonald the national record holder but in the middle of the pack looking good at the moment christopher taylor demish gate closes the gap now and uh, nibbles at the heels of christopher taylor 150 meters remaining now chris taylor demish gay and on the outside as well sean bailey is running a stout race so far off the top bed now under 100 meters to go the tempo increases this looks like it's gonna be a heck of a finish pouring through on the outside taylor comes under pressure now and coming through it looks like out oh. there sean bailey very very close 44.70 the flash time bailey finished late burrell came up there as well bailey has gotten the victory i think taylor was second 45.04 for sean bailey So we have no men running the Open 4 this year at the Olympics. But what we lost in top quality, we got in competitiveness, even through 100 meters. As they head down the back stretch, no one really taking a big lead at this point. Perhaps only Rasheen McDonald in eight, falling back a little bit. Javier Brown having a bit of work to do all the way down in lane one. On the second turn and line up we're going to see about seven of the athletes almost in an entire row look at this competitive who is going to win we don't know at this point but from the university of texas in el paso sean bailey christopher taylor push forward one two and three all right as we try to recover the flash time had us doing some jumps and Flips here in studio. Uh, we thought we had our first sub 45 and an Olympic qualification.